referred pain in ear this is because uh, the nerve supply of the ear is from various nerves which involves the 5th 9th and the 10th cranial nerve and the C2 and C3 nerves to the ear now these nerves also have varied supply to other regions as well and the, this common supply is responsible for the referred pain that is seen in ear now what are the causes of referred pain in ear first can be referred pain via the fifth cranial nerve or the trigeminal nerve this involves dental oral cavity and tm joint causes so dental causes can be caries tooth impacted molar malocclusion of teeth causes in the oral cavity involves benign or malignant ulcerative lesions and temporomandibular joint problems involve costin syndrome tm joint arthritis so these are all the causes that can uh, cause a referred pain to the ear via the fifth cranial nerve next is referred pain via the ninth cranial nerve now the ninth cranial nerve it uh, supplies the base of tongue as well so in case of base of tongue malignancy there can be a referred pain in the ear in oropharyngeal causes like acute tonsillitis peritonsillar abscess benign or malignant ulcers of soft palate or tonsils it is also seen in eagle syndrome eagle syndrome is basically when there is an elongated styloid process that compresses on the ninth cranial nerve and hence causes pain uh, referred pain to the ear so these are the causes of the ninth cranial nerve next comes referred pain via the 10th cranial nerve now these causes include laryngeal causes and thyroid causes laryngeal causes can be tb carcinomas ulcers etc whereas thyroid causes can be acute and subacute thyroiditis hashimoto thyroiditis so these are causing referred pain via the 10th cranial nerve or the vagus nerve next is referred pain via the c2 or c3 cranial nerve now c2 c3 cranial nerve uh, causes pain in cases of cervical spondylitis in carry spine these are the causes where it will cause referred pain as well in the ear so now this is a uh, precise chart here which gives you all the causes and all the all the causes of the pain in uh, referred pain in the ear as well as the uh, which are the nerves involved in each of these causes so it can involve the tonsil parotid thyroid larynx styloid process oral cavity tm joint nerve nerve origin and spine and all of these are either via the 5th 9th 10th cranial nerve or the c2 c3 cervical nerves now the neoplasms which can cause referred pain are piriform fossa glottis and supraglottis uh, ca post cricoid ca posterior pharyngeal wall ca these are all via the 10th cranial nerve posterior one third of the tongue is via the 9th cranial nerve parotid and the nasopharynx coming to common causes of referred pain even out of all of these causes that i just said the most common causes that you have to look for when there's a case of referred pain referred pain is when uh, your uh, patient is complaining of pain in the ear but every other examination of the ear is coming normal that is when you have to suspect other causes which is referred causes or uh, referred pain causes in the ear and out of them the most common ones are caries teeth impacted molar posterior tongue lesions and pharynx and tonsillar lesions so these are the common causes of referred pain